Good evening, everybody. I don't know if it is raining where you are, but it has been pouring all day here, and we do have some areas of flooding, so I hope that you're safe wherever you are. Thought we would get our hymn in before the work week started. Um, tonight we're going to learn about Praise Ye the Lord Almighty. This was written back in 1680, so a long time ago. And it was written by a German hymn writer named um, Joachim Neander. And he came from a line of preachers. His dad was a preacher, his grandfather was a preacher, and his great-grandfather was a preacher. However, um, Joachim was, um, he got in with a rebellious crowd, and he was not seeking after preaching. In fact, at the age of 20, he was with a group and they would go down to the local church and just uh, mock and scoff at the worshipers. However, on um, one of these occasions, they actually listened to the preacher and he came under conviction and he was um, led to Christ and he began a new chapter in his life. And actually, he became the assistant pastor at that same church where he mocked the worshipers at just a few years later. And uh, he, uh, he liked to go for walks out in the German countryside, and this is where he would compose his hymns at. He composed 60 hymns, but um, unfortunately, at the age of 30, he contracted tuberculosis. And uh, tuberculosis is a disease that eats your lungs from the inside out and uh, fills your lungs up with fluid. And um, then, of course, at the end, you just have trouble breathing. So he composed this song in the midst of all that. Um, he had a valley named after him because he loved to walk there so often. It's called Neander Valley. And um, it's near the Dussel River. And actually, 200 years later, after Joachim died, there was a man, um, Herr von Berdorf. He owned this property, and um, they were sourcing out the limestone. And one of his workers found a cave there, and he found bones in the cave. He took it to a local um, science teacher, and he said, well, actually, this was probably a person who died from the Great Flood. And um, Noah's Ark Flood. And the, unfortunately, there was another man that he took it to um, who discovered the bones, and it was an um, Irish man, and he said it belonged to the Neanderthal, that this was the missing link. And so um, Neander Valley from Joachim Neander now becomes known um, 200 years later for the Neanderthal. Um, so that was just a little bit of history there that I thought was fascinating. So we are going to um, sing this song together. I hope you know it, and I would love for you to join me. So here we go. Praise ye the Lord, the Almighty, the King of creation. Oh, my soul, praise him, for he is thy health and salvation. All ye who hear, now to his temple draw near. Join me in glad adoration. Praise to the Lord, oh, let all that is in me adore him. All that hath life and breath come now with praises before him. Let the amen sound from his people again. Gladly for all we adore him. Well, I hope you keep on singing his praises this week. Hope you all have a wonderful week, and I'll see you at the end of it. Good night.